right guys, well, we're in, we're gonna be doing the, you know, the mission where you've got to go on the ship and beat this, I don't know, rich lord in a game of poker, and then you just end up robbing the entire safe. I have done this before, but we are doing this on a higher difficulty and... Mm. I just gotta wait now. <sighs> Alright, so, outside Saint Denis. <sighs> and I've been told we are to go to Trelawney. I'm gonna put a waypoint there that quick. Not that we need it. Pretty much know my way around here by now. I should do. Oh, okay. I really thought I could go through that gap, but. I don't remember that. Okay. Gonna go up on here, sir. Oh, dude, why do I keep falling off now? Here I am. Well, we're going to need to get you smartened up a bit. Why? <coughs> uh, you can't play at the tables on a Lanahassee River. Just gonna join my mom's party that quick. Okay. Like this? Yeah. Not if you want to fit in so well that no one will really Yeah, I'm streaming right now. To I'm gonna make now, it make on. a Are YouTube video. Of course. We're I'm going just to doing that mission. So I just started it. Do you know the one where you have to go on the ship and um beat that guy, that rich lord in the game of poker or something? Yes, mm, my here is in need of a new suit. Make this gentleman look just gotta like buy the um the Whitmore. Can we get that? Good choice, sir. Father had to emigrate. A That's a very good choice, chap. I think. Oh, oh, finally, some neat clothes. Sure. Liam, please be quiet. But Hell, don't Strauss sing while I'm the whole thing out. It's quite ingenious, actually. What is? The then why'd you invite me plan. to the party? Indeed, it's not much of an action at all. You play cards yeah, you are meeting on the stream, I just hate hearing you. Very big and flamboyantly wild no offense. You win. And everyone's going to think you're some new money from the oil... Alright, can you please, or if you freaking... Drunk. All the while, Herr Shay will be signaling you in your line of sight. When right, you I don't think they they'll take you upstairs to pay you off. And that is when Javier comes in, and you take whatever you want. You don't think they might see an armed Mexican coming into the safe with me? Sure, they might. Oh, frick! Think peace, can't. This killing me. Oh, don't be so jaded. We both know this is just the kind of innocent fun you thrive on. Well, well after the past couple of months, armed robbery don't seem such an innocent pastime. No, but we, you. All of us Liam. will be done here soon. I hope so. Hold on, guys. Liam? Curtis? That's cool. Could you smarten up my dear hick friend here? 
Alright, we're just gonna leave this party, guys. Hold on. Mm, there we are. This unlikely fellow okay, has made himself let's... a fortune <clears throat> in the oil fields and learned himself not a lick of manners or gentlemanly deportment. Look like a prince, apparently. Well, very good, sir. No, it's not good. Not good at all. Not if they're gonna let him play big at the tables tonight. I think we look a little smarter. <laughs> there, very smart. <sighs> on, let's get to the box. I've arranged okay. some transportation for us. I'm um, just gonna get in the coach. <laughs> George! Hey, look, to the the ground here, Todd. Well, look at you! From Toad? The Prince. Uh, this is a bit much, ain't it? The coach? We can't win any up there on horses like a bunch of countrified yokels. You're a brash oil man. Money to burn. Which reminds me, no shuffling and mumbling. Puff your chest out. Get outside yourself. Yeah, all right, all right. This ain't happening. So, who's a mark? Are you all right, by the way, the driver? Oh, yes. Don't worry. George and I go way back. It's a man called Desmond Bly. Made a fortune in hosiery of all things. <laughs> Likes to play fast and always keep some extra collateral in the safe upstairs. So, if Strauss is sitting behind him, how does he know what cards I got? He won't. But the dealer has recently become a very good friend of mine. Another one. Don't worry, Arthur. We're all the authors of our own good fortune. He'll make sure you get the right cards. What could possibly go wrong? <clears throat> Indeed. <clears throat> and what money am I playing with? Don't worry. That has all been arranged. Your chips will be waiting for you. <sighs> ah, well, there she is. Come on. Okay. Arthur. Leave any weaponry here. They are searchers when we get on. George, we'll collect these from you later. Very good, sir. Thank you, George. Good luck, sir. Hey, dear, mister. Now remember what I said, Arthur. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Yes. Ah, so nice yes, ship over there, guys. Believe me, I heard <laughs> every word. Watch Strauss, listen to the dealer, and this should be a very lucky night. There they are. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you. Arthur, you remember this pair of boys we met in New York? Come on, Kevin. Champagne is on dear old Arthur. He's rich as can be and feeling luckier than a turkey that survived Thanksgiving. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, dear boy. Come on, come on, let's head aboard. Drinks on Arthur. Champagne. <laughs> I'm afraid we require all patrons to hand over their guns. Good time. The tables await. I'll go find myself a change of clothes. <sighs> okay. You seem unsure. Robbing a heavily armed riverboat without a gun tends to bring out the self-doubt in me. These people are virtually idiots. This is simple stuff. Now have a good time. But don't lose too much money, or your wife is going to kill me. Whatever you say. Now, where can I get a cocktail? Take a seat, sir. <laughs> Good evening, gentlemen. <clears throat> Arthur Kelly. Sorry, I'm late. I had some uh, unfinished business at the bar. Hey, Desmond Fly. Evening. Not to worry. Welcome to the game, Mr. Callahan. Okay, gentlemen, let's play. Hope you're a player. 
Been too many cowards at these tables recently. Nothing less dignified than a man afraid to lose a little money. Look at this! Chips already stacked up waiting for me. I like this joint already. We aim to please, sir. So, how are we all fair? Some better than others. If we all fared the same in life now, where would the fun be? Quiet. Wait, not Desmond Blythe, the hosiery king. I should have brought my other wallet. Not my preferred title, but yeah, nah, we have you to should on that have. one though. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see about that. To hell with it. Here we go then. Well, Hello, my ladies. Damn it. Mr. Blythe wins with three queens. Three queens. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, gentlemen. Jeez. I guess it's just you and me now, friend. Yes, it is. Time to see if you're really the man you seem to think you are. Likewise, Mr. Blythe. So, what business are you in, Mr. Callahan? I'm an oil man, for my sins. Funny, I haven't heard of you. Oh, you will. You know, I thought about getting into hosiery, but I just look better in a suit. I would stick to oil, Mr. Callahan. I don't think you have a future on the stage. You sound no, I don't mean to like fall. Oh, I'm still the job. Oh. And I accidentally messed that up. Look. It's good to extend the game sometimes. Time to put your money where your mouth is, Mr. Callahan. I like a confident man, Mr. Blythe. Mm -hmm. Let's up the stakes a little. I'll call. with this dilly-dallying, you know? Okay, Mr. Callahan, I'm all in. <laughs> this is gonna be a long game. I'll call. Interesting. My luck hell. Is that you done? Done? Bust. Ah, All let's, right. you got let's go. Else to play with. Meaning. Well, I heard. Well, I heard there were some big boys on this boat. Maybe that's not you. No offense. Sit your hillbilly ass down. Why? I got a watch. Look at you. An expensive one. Real fine. Swiss. A Reutlinger, no less. It's in the safe, upstairs. It's worth more than you. Okay. I trust you. Not bad. As you wish. <clears throat> so, you must know Leviticus Cornwall, big oil man like you. Of course, we've crossed paths. I was fortunate enough to tour a little operation of his up in New Hanover. <laughs> I am 100% all in, Mr. Callahan. Don't worry, sir. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Pear cake. Very good, but 
Not good enough. Shit. Uh oh. Yes, you little beauty. Hard lines, Mr. Blind. Mr. Callahan wins with an ace high diamond flush. God damn you! No offense. None taken. Well played, sir. On, Dr. Desmond. Now, forgive my lack of discretion, but uh, where might I find this watch? It's upstairs. Shall we go and have a look? Why not? Gentlemen, please cash these out for me. I, I started last week. Good. Sure. Perhaps you could escort us up to the office. Yes, of course, sir. Thank you. Follow me, gentlemen. Come with me, sir. You're having quite the night. Yeah, so far. I cannot believe someone gave a greaser a job. <laughs> we live in strange times. Personally, I wouldn't trust one with a gun, but fear not. I've got my own little lawgiver right here. Very good. Next, we'll be hiring Negroes. Yeah, I know, I know. I think you're going to like this watch, sir. I Man, where's this, this waypoint's kind of triggering my LCD. I don't like it. I saw Especially like the map colors. And it really is a handsome piece. Foreign made, but you can't have everything. Indeed. Well, here we are. Just give me one second, sir. Of course, take your time. Don't reach for that gun. Take his gun, Arthur. I guess you were right. Only an idiot would give a greaser a gun. Huh? I... Oh shit, let's hope no one heard that. Quick, clear the safe, let's get out of here. Can't believe that asshole had another gun. The view in here is looking pretty good. How much is there? Must be a few thousand plus the watch. Nice. Now let's get out of here, come on. Let's go meet the others. Sure. I reckon we've only got a few minutes to get out of here. If we're lucky. Was that a gunshot? It sounded like one. Come on. And how exactly are we getting out of here? I ain't too sure. This is what tends to happen when you leave Trelawney in charge of planning. Oh, garnish no meat. Probably involve us dressing up as dancing girls and can cannon off the side. Nice uniform, by the way. Thanks. Give anyone a job these days. Anyway, we shouldn't give ourselves away until we know we need to. Maybe we could still blend Pretty into the crowd successful when it night. crazy. Which it surely will. <laughs> to the bar, senor! I hope you had fun, sir. <laughs> At the time of my life. You boys sure know how to put on a show. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> ah, look, there's your friend. My friend is not a noble cheat, and I beg you to take back the insinuation. There he is. Now, don't be a sore loser, friend. There's something I don't like about the pair of you. <laughs> There's plenty I don't like about you, but I have the good manners to keep my mouth shut. There he is! Shoot that man! <laughs> Come on, Arthur! We gotta get out of here!
Uh, they'll say we have to swim all the way back. Well, have a dull moment. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. So, how much did we get? A few thousand, I think. Pretty good. Yes, indeed. And this watch, uh, apparently it's worth a bunch of Swiss, uh, a Reutlinger or something. Nice watch. Yes, it's a Reutlinger, all right. <laughs> We'll give it back then. All right, come on, let's get out of here. Reminds me a lot about the GTA series, Stranger and Freaks, they were. Didn't really care much about them, but they were good missions. I believe we have yeah. that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Unfortunately so, Mr. Uh, Arthur Morgan, at least sometimes. Uh, can I say something rude? Sure. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Oh, uh, to be clear, he, he wasn't very upset about it. All right, he guys, rather uh... liked you. Well, the stream hey, was meant to be just you, on that uh, mission, but, uh... I mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Well, Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. Miller? Hmm. Well, I'm sorry. Might extend Have it. you met? This is Rain's Fall, a great chief, and his son, Eagle Flies. Gentlemen, we saw you in the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. We have great powers of observation. It's my people if we are even a people anymore. We've fought hard. We've made peace. Treaties were broken, and we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. I'm sure. And now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger. And we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Well, it's a bad business. It's to do with oil. I know it is, but I need the proof. I believe there were some prospectors who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. So, you want me to try and steal it? Obviously, they can't. And even more obviously, I would be useless. Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but oh, what? I wanna... I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. 
The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here is nigh undone. We understand, and we will pay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, an appointment with the Senator. We should head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his. No. We must try everything. Come along. I'm not sure Hello. if this is the mission where Mr. it takes Miller, us on an The council island. wants to apologize. He can see you now. We've been waiting I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. Yeah. Uh, what now? Eagle Files. What? Oh, what? Oh, oh, oh. All right, hold on, hold on. Eagle Files, right? All right. Well, that's that, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure entirely what that was. Come on, boy. But, um... Hmm. Getting paid handsomely sounds nice. We're gonna drive to our next mission and we're gonna extend this so that Yeah, we can do that one. Ah, it works now, doesn't it? I really actually need to consider buying a new horse, I just can't be asked. What the freak is it? It's a freaking 10 XC walker. So you know we're at camp um, by the swamp lakes where all those alligators? People, oh, let me guess another one. Help me. Oh. Hey, you. Please. I'm not sure me. I can be asked. Some fellas broke into our place. I got away, but they got my wife. Please, mister. This ain't my business, friend. I gotta go find help. <sighs> Fine. I'll help you. It's a sacked out in the swamp by the water. <laughs> Okay. Go on, see if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. That didn't fail the mission. Yep. Oh, well, yeah. Mr. Witness. Hey, 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 I'm sure we're good friends, aren't we? Very good friends, very good friends. This is on. Okay, two. It's not what it looks like. It's not what it looks like. see a bit of a cinematic and all, but I don't know. I'm not entirely, this is, this is not my favourite game. It's not something I really care too much about. It's just, it's got a good storyline and that's the main thing, really. <sighs> Should we have to get, uh, I think was, I, I want to spend my money quickly though, because yeah. it, I always lose it when I die. And I don't like that. Yeah. 
Can I not cross? Oh no, because there's alligators. Yeah, we don't care. Yeah, they are definitely alligators, aren't they? Or some sort of sea creature. That I assume is harmful. I thought you'd run off to join the circus. Huh? Circus? No. How you doing, Mrs. Adler? How are you? Been quite a journey since I... Uh... Well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. My lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> if he can do it, anyone can. You get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on, we need to talk. Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? When are you gonna let me come Robin with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. Yeah. A few more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world left. Yes, perhaps. Now, to the trolley bus station. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city. I, I like how there's missions that actually have the title of Sadie You're Adler and say Mary oh, Beth, but you end up doing me? the actual no, mission we'll need one for more, completely I different reckon. people. I say Lenny, not Michael. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a payday. No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Make him change. Very funny. What is that? Oh no, this is the sad oh this is the hard one. Oh, the oh gross. Look what they did. Hey, the tree line. Everybody take cover! Or Bristol Boys are coming! Oh crap. Oh boy. Windows covered quickly. John, you take the windows over there. Charles, you take the side door there. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go! I uh, have a feeling. I know what to do. Is everyone accounted for? I think. Hey! I said, is everyone accounted for? I don't know! I think! Shut up, Marston. and you see what happened to him? That's Mr. Sadler. She's still out there. Come on. 
cover me. Okay. Look what we got here. Hold on. We need you in the house, Mrs. Adler. Remedy, remedy, remedy. Thank you. Oh, 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 that is right. Okay. I think so. Except for Karen here. Uh, poor kid. Mr. Swanson, could you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the body. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come on now, work. Comb O'Driscoll. That man can really hate. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm not sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. 
Shall we? Yep. Kieran, that poor kid we spared from O'Driscoll's gang up in the mountains is dead. They chopped his head off and tried to kill the lot of us. The whole place gives me the creeps. simple I guess. Arthur. A bit too simple, a bit too quick. You know what that means? It means more content from your boy. Oh crap. It was just dunk. Long time, boy. Did not sound pretty. Decided to pull his gun out at me. Can anybody show me some kindness? Nah, you can die. Keep walking. Wanna... You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave forever. We've been doing well, making money, but for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia. Oh, or this to is, this is we just want. need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear. Be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific, an untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. 
We made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now, remember, we just want money. Okay. Don't make us kill Give me you. Everything you got, Mr. F. Quick. Leave these fine folks of their valuables, Mr. F. Check that room back there. I got this one. Dying. It's now choice. I'm gonna need I'm everything gonna... you got on you. Time to investigate and let my acquaintance inside. All your money now. Don't make me ask twice. Okay. Hey. Ah. Go in. There's nothing much here. What? There's nothing really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here. Okay. And get then, ready partner. for company. Hold still. All of you. Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! Okay, I think they got the message. Hey, that is not what we do, damn it. You know that. There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Come on now! We got you surrounded! That's greasy son of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are we gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! Go! Oh now! Go! Does this trolley go to Tahiti? Nothing moves. 
Let's get out of here, Arthur. You okay, Doug? Took a real bang on the head back there. I'm seeing three of everything. Stay down. I'll hold them off. Coming from behind us. Get rid of them. Looks like they ain't giving up yet. I think we're clear. You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. <clears throat> thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Well, we each got... $15. <coughs> oh, and a quarter. <coughs> Don't forget the quarter. <coughs> Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. <clears throat> Played me like a yokel. Put the law on us. What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? We just need money. One more decent take, and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Hosea agrees. Even after that? Uh, especially after that. Uh, I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on. I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, can't win them all. Hello. I am currently making a YouTube video now. Mm. Now he's trying to tell you. Oh, it worked for me. Hello. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because it has to say, like, it was doing the flashy thing, and, like, it has to say, yeah, uh, you have to join the party. Not look in the party and say, oh, we're in. Yeah, some people it does that, some people it doesn't. Well, at fair point, it does it, but. Oh, I don't know.
Alright guys, I'm gonna end the stream though. It's been nice playing and um if you wanna see more content like this with me, um be sure to leave a like on the video and um